Hello guys, today I am going to install the Dirty Unicorn Room which runs on 6.0.1 Marshmallow on Samsung Galaxy S2 S2. So without any further delay, let's get started. To install this room, you have to download the main room file and G apps. And the links are given in the description. Now turn off your device. Now press the power button, volume up button and the home button at the same time to go into the recovery mode. Now select wipe, then click on advanced wipe. Now select only the first 5 options. Now swipe to wipe. Now click on home button and click on install. Now select the storage. Click on micro SD card and then click on OK. Now uh, open the folder. Now select the dirty unicorn ROM 6.0.1 and now swipe to confirm flash. Now click on back, then select open G apps and now swipe to confirm flash. Now Click on Reboot System. Now you will boot it in your new ROM. Now select the language, now click on next, skip, if you see android keyboard AOSB has stopped then you have to download any keyboard application and you have to uh, use that for typing, without any application you can't um, access your keyboard. So. Um, I will explain and show you how you can access the keyboard by installing the application in few minutes. For now uh, close this and uh, click on skip anyway.
now just select uh, just complete these steps Next, click on got it. Now, uh, now you have successfully installed the dirty unicorn room, which runs on six point. 0.1 marshmallow on Samsung Galaxy S2 S2. So now I will tell you how you can access the keyboard. As you can see uh, that uh, you can't access the keyboard. See when you will try to access the keyboard it will show this. And uh, to access that first we have to download any uh, um, keyboard application from another device or before installing this ROM and you have to place that file in your SD card now uh, open documents and then select SD card and just uh, install that uh, file I have downloaded the google keyboard.apk you can download any uh, keyboard and settings and then enable unknown sources I install it accept Now uh, click on open Now enable in setting Now uh, enable this google keyword Then click ok Then select input method then select the second option English India Google Keyboard then set permissions then we have to allow this Google Keyboard then see keyboard features then here it will uh, um, this is the thing which you can do in this uh, keyboard then you can directly skip or uh, you can check that out now uh, you can um, change the settings from your preferences or themes I mean, it, uh, this app is very customizable and now uh, now you can just access the keyboard very easily thanks for watching if this video was helpful to you please give a thumbs up and subscribe for new updates